Good morning. How are you guys doing? Hope you guys are well and hope you guys are doing great. <sighs> okay, so before you start asking questions why I'm sounding like this, let me quickly make it clear. One, I am not feeling too well. And this has been for the whole week since on since on Sunday evening. So last week Sunday and today is Friday already. And all throughout this week, I only went to school once, which was on Wednesday. Actually, Monday and Tuesday, we had three days. We, we didn't have classes. And on Wednesday, I went to school. I just managed to see if I can, but I went to school. I had to come back early before 12. I was already home. So on Thursday, I couldn't go. Today is Friday. I couldn't go. I am strengthless and I have this crazy headache. So on Wednesday when I was coming back from school, I did a COVID test. It was negative. Today, after talking with my teacher, you know, telling her I'm not, I won't be able to come today. So she told me to go retake the test again because I've not been to the doctor. And if you spend more than two days at home without being in class, you have to bring what they call um a, a, ooh, something like that a, ooh, something like that like an excuse to the school so i've not been to the doctor there's no way i can provide that so i told her if this persists um throughout the weekend definitely on monday i will go as i'm talking i'm already out of strength I will go to the doctor and check what is wrong with me but i feel this is one of those things that happens to me sometimes i just get i don't know i wouldn't say i'm stressed i just have some things i'm thinking about at the moment and <clears throat> the fact that i haven't found a way around it it's 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 stressing me out so i've just been looking for something to motivate me to get me off my bed there was absolutely nothing so i just received the call right now that i think they will be delivering my my wardrobe today i hope it's the wardrobe done because they had to call me to ask if i'm home so yeah so i had to get up just do a little bit of hygiene and put on something so i can receive the items if i see that it motivates me more see my bed is not made here yeah, you know that's not usually me but if i see that i'm not like i don't have the, um, the strength that i need to put that um, item together i'll just leave it until i can but if i see that i can push myself i will you know just do it and get it off ground so that's basically what so even my clothes the clothes i need to iron they are here i haven't been able to do that but i'm going to try to fix my bed because i don't like to see my bed like this it makes me feel like it makes me anxious like i don't feel relaxed especially when my place my space is cluttered and you know unorganized you get so yeah i'm going to try to fix this bed right now oh, look at for you guys to see look at the type later these ones are out of okay no i didn't just take all of these but these ones are empty already you get so i was thinking maybe i should be taking my allergy pill again maybe that's why because of course i have a stuffy nose right now i don't know this sound has been happening since on uh, wednesday i guess i think they are doing some some renovation or whatever
this is what it looks like from here. This one goes to the bathroom for washing. I have a couple of clothes to wash. All right, now that I'm done with here, I feel good. You know, a little bit with the way here looks. My this thing is still there. I'm going to leave it down till I get a sofa because it's of no use having the rug on the floor with our sofa and table, like a center table. So. is heavy these two items right here especially this one the one I brought in last I don't know how I think I don't know I don't even know what to think right now so hey Jesus how can I put this thing together <laughs> oh by the way you guys I don't know I think I was saying in one of my one of my vlog or so that my younger brother is here in Germany so he's coming to visit me next week you guys next week i am nervous i am super excited everything is just it's just a mixed feeling to be honest because you know first of all i've not hosted anyone before and you know i don't know big sister duty i i haven't really done in person you know for a very very long time i don't know if you guys get what i mean so but however sha we'll see I don't know. I don't even know how to feel right now, but we move. <laughs> Ooh, you guys. So these, this is what they look like after opening them up. Guys, I don't even know where to start from. So these are the tools, the screws, and everything I need to set this wardrobe up, guys. This is overwhelming because I don't know where to start from. Oh my god. Guys, 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 guys. Do you know what the time is? Let me check. This is 5.38. The last time I spoke to you guys was 9, 10 in the morning yes <laughs> you will not believe what happened today you guys oh my god oh my days anyways the wardrobe has been fixed um before i show you guys what that looks like and also um tell you guys about the story that happened today i need to quickly iron this clothes and fold them off ground i'm trying to cook something for me in the in the kitchen actually there was <laughs> like today 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 you know there's just that one day that will almost frustrate you and make you think like god why that was what today was all about but i overcame i'm, I'm going to tell you guys all of that herbert and the, the sister and the father they just left and now i'm just trying to put things together because we went i went to i went shopping with the with the kids I told you guys my brother will be coming by next week, Monday. Oh my god, I am so excited. Anyway, so my bed is messed up. Oh, I'm already showing you guys. No, 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 no. So me, I quickly iron those clothes and I'll get back to you guys to come and share my story with you.
used to give all I have I'm used to get nothing back Wherever I go, it's the same There's no excuses, no one to blame Sometimes I can understand Alright you guys, so I'm done I need the clothes so I had to leave them here because I'm going to fix everything into the um, the wardrobe all right I don't know if I can do that today that would depend on how I'm feeling after I've eaten and taking my medicine all right but if I cannot I'll do it tomorrow I'm not in a rush or in a hurry to do that okay do you guys see my mirror you see how much <laughs> you can see my my this single chair that i have here so my mirror is hung already i really appreciate andre for all he did today yeah he came to help me fix my wardrobe and fix this mirror as well okay so i'm gonna go dish my food and go into the bedroom oh no first of all let me show you guys the wardrobe okay so the front of it this is what it looks like I'm going to turn or rather flip the camera over to show you guys properly but yeah this is what it looks like I don't have anything in it yet yeah this is it this is how it looks like and this is the space it took so this is it is not too high I really love how um how high oh this is one thing. <laughs> This is one problem. So because of the space, this door cannot open properly. You see that? But trust me, darlings, this isn't a problem at all. So this is what the inside looks like. This is the hangar space. I love the fact that it also has this extra space right here, which we take a lot of things. Maybe my bags are going to go in here. And yeah, this is it. I'm not gonna make another noise in here and this is the space where the folded clothes will be at okay see that amazing yeah oh yeah it does have extra space right here okay so yeah <laughs> yeah this is what it looks like right now okay when i flip over like this then you're going to have my bed and the reason I, I don't know if i've told you guys already but the reason i had to change this space like this is because i'm filming from this window space right here the lighting comes out better yeah this is what the room looks like right now i can't wait to start putting things on the wall oh i really really like it i'm really grateful i'm really happy about this and oh before anything i want to say a big thank you to every one of you without you guys this won't be possible to be honest i have to be sincere with you guys without you guys this won't be possible and most of the things that i buy in this house won't be possible for that i am super 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 grateful thank you so much you get so yeah that's it I can't wait to fix this rug when the sofa is here. I've not ordered yet to I never get money. So that's what's up. I'm gonna dish my food because I'm hungry and I have this interesting movie I've been watching, you know, just to cool myself down. As you guys can tell, you can tell I feel better, right? Ooh, did I forget to tell you guys the story of the story that the story of my life today? Hmm. So when Andre was done with everything he did, they were about to leave. So I was seeing them out and I forgot to take my key. Did I have actually forgot? Not really because I think I'm used to the fact that if I'm leaving my, my, my apartment, I always take my key. Like it, the thing is here, I can't forget it. I don't know if that makes sense. But because I wasn't going downstairs, I just want to see them to the door you know the kit um so i think i just didn't think of it because i you know my subconsciousness you know things or rather know that i'm not going far or going downstairs or going out basically so i was saying hello and bye to the kids and all of that before i knew the wind just blew and closed and shut the door boom 
just like that <laughs> and if you live in germany you know what it costs to call um what's it called the people that comes to open the door when you have uh, like a lockdown no lockdown when you lock yourself up guys <laughs> the lock that i have like the lock that i have see this is my god eh? <laughs> he just know how to rescue me all the time okay thank god andre has not gone yet and i was like my door is closed my door is closed he was like where is your key i'm like i don't have a key if i have a key i won't be saying my door is closed he tried every miss he could to open up the door nothing happened so he had to call someone that he knows and the person said he's a bit far that if we can wait we should wait so that was how he came and helped me open up my door Hmm, Jesus Christ. We all for see 700 at the 700 plus for this afternoon. For this, it's like to take give one person to help me open the door. 700 euro plus. I mean, 750, something like that. We are for see on. Hey, Jesus. So, see, I was furious. My head then began, my head began to pound. Like, say that the pound pounded yam for my head. Jesus. I was. Thank God I was not cooking already. If not, another story will for the here today. But yeah, all glory be to God. That was what happened, and this is where we are today. <laughs> so when the door opened, you know when you you know when something happened, you will be looking at it. If it's a dream, you'll be like, oh God, please, if this is a dream, let me wake up. If this is a dream, let me wake up. God, please let it be that this is a dream. That was what I was thinking when I was sitting on the staircase. <laughs> That's why I don't see rich oh. That's why I don't see rich today. <laughs> so Naimo, I don't cook, I won't eat. I didn't hungry you guys. I didn't hungry. So I'm just gonna go chill. Do I wanna drink C20? I'm not sure. No, I wanna drink water because I'm gonna take medicine. So I have water in the bedroom, right? Let me just take this in case. So I'm gonna sit my phone. I'm just gonna go sit on the bed and put on my movie and watch. Then, if I can't get power, if I do not sleep off because this medication does makes me feel dizzy and you know sleepy and all. So if I do not sleep off, if I still have strength, I will start fixing my clothes into this wardrobe, this beautiful wardrobe. But if not, it's gonna be tomorrow. Okay. So. May I eat? I'll talk to her later. <laughs>